what happens with obesity? Number one, you have insulin resistance, typically. Number two, you have overproduction of VLDL particles that are enriched with triglycerides. And that, that drives an exchange of triglycerides that come off of those VLDL particles and go on to HDL and LDL particles in exchange for cholesterol. So you end up with high triglycerides, smaller, denser HDL and LDL particles. The other thing with insulin resistance you get is that you're overworking the pancreas because the pancreas has to put out more insulin to dispose of the glucose in the bloodstream. And over time, the pancreas kind of burns out and is no longer able to produce enough insulin to maintain normal glucose levels. So the result of that is, you know, impaired glucose tolerance, prediabetes, and ultimately you end up with type 2 diabetes. So obesity drives a lot of you know, really negative metabolic consequences.